Hello, people. And this is just me. That Unsuck Mario, Mario and Harley uh, didn't want to join me for this. And in a minute, you'll see why. Now, people. I, you know, you know I hate Catcom and everything that they do now. But guess, but guess what? They said, I keep, I hear from a very reliable source that even though they're doing the, the, um, the little iPad thing that's so dumb, that's so, that's so dumb, so simplistically simple, the Mega Man game that's so dumb, so simplistically simple, it took, it took three dudes to program that game in like a day. Well, in like a freaking, like just one day. Now, I keep hearing that they say they might show more of the Blue Bomber. There's, they're, they pretty much read Don't Make Cry. I hear, I hear freaking, um, I hear freaking Resident Evil 6 ain't doing so hot either. Oh god. And it worries me because what are they gonna do with Mega Man? I mean, is is I mean is that what they're gonna stick with an all rail shooter? Oh god, guys, I I don't know what the future holds for Mega Man, but God dang, there's nothing the cat crap cop have already said. I don't really believe. I mean, yeah, there'll probably be more Mega Man games, but since they're uh, since the guy who used to make all the Mega Man games left. Capcom is unsure what they're gonna do. So, oh, they're gonna they're going to probably run it into the ground, and I, I'm really I really wish they didn't. But you know, Capcom's Capcom, and they'll always they'll always want your money. They're like they're like the Montana Max of the gaming world. They will want your money no matter how, and it doesn't even matter how they get it. They just get it. Whether they get you, they get you buy something with DLC that's something that should be in the game, or something else. All they want is our money. They don't care about us fans anymore. They, you know, they stop caring. But you know, the one, the but the real thing that really bugs me about the whole thing, they canceled all these Mega Man games so they can freaking have the Mega Man anniversary game that's only on an iPad. And two, it's an on rail shooter. Now, I wouldn't be mad at it. I wouldn't be mad if it was on the iPad if it, if it at least had good platforming. But it doesn't, people. I looked at a freaking representation of that game. It's an on rail shooter. Through and through. And you know how mad that makes You know how angry that makes me? It makes me want to go to Catcom and freaking smack them in the face. Now I no, now I wouldn't really truly do that, but seriously, it makes me want to. It makes me contemplate that whole idea in my head. But, but no, no, Catcom doesn't deserve my rage or anger because really, it's going exactly as I predicted. It's going exactly as I predicted for Capcom. They're still gonna make money, sure, but they're gonna lose all their fans in the process of their money grubbing ways. But you know, it's 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 cool. Watch, I predict in the next few years or so they're going to plummet. Capcom is going to go going to gonna either. Capcom's gonna file for bankruptcy. That's what I think's gonna happen. Okay, they're not gonna have any money left because no one's gonna buy their games because they're money grubbing douchebags that only care about our money and not the quality of their products anymore, or because they like breaking off pieces of games and having you pay for them at a later time. So you know they they're gonna they're gonna fall hard and fast like. Kind of like how Sega did when they still made, when Sega did when they made consoles. But you know, with Capcom, they're just gonna they're they're not gonna like um, team up with Nintendo and everybody else. They're just gonna go down. That's what I predict. That's why I'm predicting Capcom's future. 
because they keep on messing with these franchises. They mess with Devil May Cry. They 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 mess with Devil May Cry. Made it more dumb. They dumbed it down. Um, I keep hearing that Resident Evil Resident Evil Six kind of sucks and the execution's a little slow and it doesn't feel like a survival horror game at all. You know stuff like that. So I keep you know I keep hearing all this stuff about what's going on in Capcom and really they're just gonna go downhill from here, folks. I'm sorry. Uh, Capcom to me is just gonna you know they're they're gonna keep doing what they're doing to Mega Man, to all their franchises, and then it's just gonna, you know, it's, we're gonna see one last game, and then, boop, it's gone forever. It's gone because of Capcom's greed, not, not anything, not anything else, and yet, and if Capcom blames it on his fans what, that, that their company is gone, you know what I'm gonna do, and if they have a twit, if they still have a Twitter, and I have a Twitter, I'm gonna be like, you did this to yourselves. All of you did this to yourselves. You have no one to blame but yourselves. Yeah, you constantly, you constantly butchered franchises that you've created. Yeah, you make you make us pay for DLC. That you know, make us pay for features that should be already in the game. We don't have to pay for it. You know. So they're gonna go down. They're gonna go down hard and fast. Mark my words. We're all gonna, we're all gonna what? One year? A few years from now? And this is the sound of every. This is sound of Capcom losing money. And them crashing hard. And I mean hard. I am not kidding. At th I'm not kidding about this. They are going to go down. That's why I see in the future. Because after a while, no one's really going to buy their games anymore. Now, I'm going to buy Phoenix Wright because they better not screw that up. I swear to God, I love I love the Phoenix Wright series so freaking much. And I do not want them to mess with it. But if they even, if they even mess with that. Or if I don't see Project X... If Project X Zone doesn't come out for, well, if Project X Zone doesn't come out for um, American audiences, which I don't actually see happening. I mean, maybe I keep hearing sales are doing well, so maybe, uh, maybe, um, maybe a year from now they'll put Project X Zone out so we can all play it. But even then, I don't think they will, and even if they do, it's kind of a stretch. But hey, that might not that might and might not happen. That might and probably probably won't happen, but I'm not really entirely sure about that. But you know, other than that, I really just feel like Catcom's just still going down. And you know, they're gonna they're gonna keep going down until eventually they go bankrupt. So all I have to say, Catcom, you know, enjoy enjoy your greed. Enjoy your greed. See how long it lasts you, as a company. See how long your money growing ways last you, Capcom. You have, you mark my words, you guys are going down. And it won't be by the fans. You will not be able to blame it on the fans. You will blame it on yourselves. And if you do, I swear to God, I'm coming back more ticked off more angry, more irritated, more annoyed than I ever have before. And trust me, you ain't gonna want to see that. So, see you guys later. This is Bugsy. Cat crap con crap con. I hope you I hope you I hope from, I hope you do, I hope you don't file for bankruptcy. I hope you learn the error of your ways. But then again, I'm kind of living in a fantasy world, so see you later. And for all you folks at home, I'm sorry, Catcom freaking deserved it. And I hope, and I pray to God that some other company gets the rights to have Mega Man because Catcom, even though they created it, 
They don't know what to do with Mega Man anymore. Their their lead guy that always that helps makes you know the lead the lead guy that helps make you know that works on the Mega Man series is pretty much gone. And now they're all like wondering what to do with the Mega Man series. You know they're going like what should we do? What should we do? What should we do? So yeah, Mega Man Mega Man is pretty much already dead. To is going to be dead because they're going to change it a lot because they all know what they're doing and it's it's going to happen folks and I'm just saying be ready be ready be prepared that's all I'm saying be prepared because Catcom is going to fall faster and harder than anybody could ever possibly know now I'm going to stop talking because this has been way too long this is only supposed to be like an eight minute video but Oh well, I had to put my prediction in there, so see you guys later. Um, subscribe if you want to. Subscribe if you want to. If you don't, well, you know, you don't have to. You know, I'm not forcing you to watch my channel. I'm not forcing you to do anything. You know, if you don't want to see my channel, you can go. So see you guys later. This is just Buzzy, and I'm signing off. See you soon.